Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Saucy Sunday. It's your boy, Eric. So I was at Trader Joe's recently, and I saw a couple sauces that caught my attention. One of them we're gonna be reviewing today, and then the other we'll do in a future episode. But today's sauce from Trader Joe's, we are looking at their own sweet chili sauce. You know, this caught my attention because one of my favorite types of foods is Chinese food. Just right off the bat, you can see how this kind of resembles Chinese food in a way. It kind of looks like duck sauce or something you dip uh, an appetizer at a Chinese restaurant. It has that very uh, like pepper flaky but duck sauce kind of vibe going for it. And yeah, because of that, it caught my attention and I decided maybe I'll give it a try on the show. So this is Trader Joe's Sweet Chili. Their sweet chili sauce is a take on the blend of chilies and garlic used in Asia. This is great for dipping. It also makes a terrific hors d'oeuvre. Just pour over cream cheese and serve with crackers. Interesting. I'd be curious to try that actually. But yeah, you can see what I was talking about earlier. You can see those red chili flakes. Some of the ingredients that are listed in this sauce are water, sugar, red chili, uh, modified tapioca starch, uh, garlic, acetic acid, and salt. Sounds pretty simple, but it looks pretty nice. So let's give this a try. Give it a little shake. So you'll notice today that not only do I have wings, but I also have a plate of rice because if this is a sweet chili sauce made for basically Chinese food, it makes sense to try it with some rice. I don't see why not. So have a wing, have a little bit of rice. Ooh, I like that pop. Let's give it a quick whiff. Mmm, I can definitely smell that garlic. It kind of ha actually has an Italian dressing vibe going for it also now that I look and smell it. Because I can smell, I think it's the, uh, I want to say it's the acid that's giving off that, uh, <clears throat> giving off that sense of a dressing. So it kind of smells a little bit like Italian dressing also, but it's definitely more potent with the garlic. I don't know if I really smell the chilies all that much though. So let's pour this out. We're just gonna pour it to the side in case this ends up not working for some reason. Yeah, just looking at it, it really reminds me of duck sauce, like what I would dip my egg rolls in. Let's give this a taste. We'll try it first on the wing. Ooh, ooh, that's tasty. Yeah, that's good. You know what it actually tastes like, now that I'm thinking about it? A while back, or on the Labor Day special actually, we tried a Frank's Red Golden Garlic Sauce, and everyone thought that had like a zest of uh, Chinese. This tastes very similar actually. Yeah, this tastes like the Golden Garlic Sauce from Frank's Red. Wow. Yeah, that's tasty. It's very sweet. Not hot at all. Like there's chili pepper in there, but not spicy. This is very easy to take down. I can 100% see this being good for like making your own egg rolls or some sort of maybe a Chinese chicken dish you make at home. I want to see what it tastes like with the rice. Bon appetit. Yeah, it's not bad. I think I liked it a little bit more on the chicken than I did on the rice, but it's still a pretty good rice sauce. Oh, yeah. Very tasty. I'm gonna keep this one around for sure. Good job, Trader Joe's. You never disappoint. <laughs> so yeah, that'll do it for this episode, guys. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, if you have a suggestion for a sauce, definitely leave that in the comments. We love trying different sauces from different places. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. See you guys.